There we go, video number three. Uh, here I am in my neighborhood. I'm taking a video of what used to be my garage, gas station, where the guy decided that selling gas was just too much trouble these days, so he gave up selling gas. Now he's just a mechanic, so if you notice the station has no identification on it whatsoever. There's a Chinese restaurant over there. This is the shopping center where we get our groceries. Here's something that Maverick will recognize. And over down in the corner, I don't know if you can tell, but there's a metro station. The metro is our, our name for the subway station. It's called a metro because it stays completely underground, whereas the subway comes above ground sometimes. So, it's a corner. I'll be it for now, and I'll uh, start again at another point. Right, here we are. I'm at a, another street in my neighborhood where a friend of mine I've known since high school lives in. And I see his brother, for some reason, is, seems to be blow-drying his father's car. Let's go find out what's going on. Oh, he's washing the car. Ah. Hi, Christopher. I'm, you're on video. <laughs> one. Yeah, I know, eh? It's supposed to be below zero by this afternoon again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, still looks good. Yeah. Well, it still looks good for 92. My 95. Ford is in worse shape than this. No, no, no. Yeah, he's a Cadillac man. He's a Cadillac man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of course. It's what I would go for. Actually, I'd prefer the Cadillac CTS, but that's my style, you know. Uh, it's front-wheel drive, this one. Oh, I didn't think they made big cars like that front-wheel drive. Uh, yeah, it looks like a bigger car. Uh, Yeah, the Japanese steel is not as good quality. That's why they use a lot of recycled metals, so it rusts faster. But you know, you buy a car nowadays. You should only plan to keep it five years. You know, when it starts to have problems, get rid of it, get another one. I, I heard, yeah, engine crack block or something. Oh boy. Oh well. All right. Yeah. Take it easy. I'll continue my video. I'm taking a video of my neighborhood for my friends on my forum so they can see my neighborhood. Okay. Take it easy, Chris. Ow. That was my friend's brother, Christopher, his younger brother. And that, as you can see, is our local McDonald's. And over there is the KFC, which is also a Taco Bell. And I was so looking forward to tacos from Taco Bell because I've heard about them and never had them. And I had them for the first time this summer. And that'll be the last time I have them because they were horrible. This is a little park, a little kitty park, which as you can see in the winter is not used. So I think I'll end this now. And there it is, the Taco Bell KFC from the front end. And this is the main boulevard in my neighborhood. I don't know if I'll be able to point it this way because I'm in the sun now. Coming up to my street there with the street lights, that's my street.
somebody waiting for the bus over there. It's lunchtime now, so there's a little more traffic than usual and a few more people walking around. Screwing about until they have to get back to work. And here's my street. Now you guys have seen it from my house looking down the street. Now this is from the down the street looking up the street. Different view, different angle. Oh, by the way, it's above zero. That's above freezing for you Americans. It's everything's dripping. It was raining earlier this morning. Now it's clearing up and it's going to go way below freezing by the night again. Nice weather. Indication of our general screwed up weather patterns all over the world, basically. I really don't know how much time I'm running up on this because I can't see the screen in the sun. Noisy truck. I'll give you a little view of things. Satellite dishes everywhere. So I don't understand why people want satellite dishes when you got cable TV because satellite dishes are affected by wind, rain, snow, trees, just about anything interferes with the signal. Because I know so many people got satellite dishes and gave them up because whenever it does something outside, like a snow or rain, they get lousy reception or no reception. So a lot of people have gone back to cable TV. You can see I'm coming up to my house. That's not a purple car, by the way, Maverick. It's blue. <laughs> it's called electric blue, to be precise. Science sort of shines in the sun. Luminous type of quality to the color. And across the street. My car, my house, everything's wet, sloppy, ice, and I'm home. So, I'll say